Authorities have a burning suspicion someone intentionally tried to set a mosque on fire in East Harris County. It's, it's very painful. Such an incident like this, very painful. Firefighters arrived at North Shore Mosque in the Cloverleaf neighborhood early this morning to find the doors on fire. They knocked out the fire before it could spread, preventing any major damage. Investigators say the perp used an ignitable liquid on the door and slashed the tires of the car belonging to the mosque's imam. The ATF and FBI are working together to determine if this was a hate crime. I don't want to say it's a hate crime or some kids did it or whatever they did. It looks like it's a hate crime, but it's so bad. The mosque mystery in Cloverleaf comes just days after a federal jury found 26-year-old Mark Vincent Perez guilty of multiple felonies, including a hate crime for torching the Victoria Islamic Center last year. The Islamic Center raised over a million dollars to rebuild the mosque, which officials say will reopen in October. No matter what worship place it is, it's a Muslim or Christian or Jewish or Buddhism, we're not supposed to hate each other, you know. We're supposed to love each other, you know. Meantime, the Houston Office of the Council on American Islamic Relations, also known as CARE, is urging stepped-up security for all Texas mosques. If surveillance cameras can be installed, that's phenomenal. If we can have a security guard there at least during most of the night, if not all of the night, then that we ask for gates to be closed and remain locked for responsible persons to take charge. We are also hopeful. We know that our community is always resilient.